Let's go. Yeah. I'm like an addict, do I gotta have it? I ain't even playing, got a really bad habit. If it moves, gotta grab it. Fuse like a magnet, lose won't have it till I'm doomed in a casket. I ain't playing, got a weird mind If you work eight hours, I'ma work nine If the shit tastes sour, you should taste mine I'ma stay in power for a long time Get up, nah, I ain't a quitter Toss me the ball, I'm a really big hitter Big picture, I'm a straight killer Rise in the song to the highest bidder Got juice, got gas, I'ma move fast New shoes, new tracks, like who's that? I'm new, come back, better than last Yeah, it's a new me, never gonna look back Never gonna look back Damn, I was built to last. You move slow when I move fast. And that's facts. Only I can make a change. Alright. Alright, welcome back to the episode of SC Racing. Been on the road for about 30 minutes so far. As you can see, we've got the yard bird in tow. Heading down to Florida, down to BMF Racing. Going to see Charles Johnson. We're going to get this cooling system lined out. Possibly pull a rock solid motorsports front end on it depending on how much time we got. So uh, I'm probably about 16 miles from hitting the interstate. So I'll just kind of keep you guys updated as we go along. So it'll be a long weekend, but it'll be a good time to get some shit lined out with the car. So here we go. Just to give a little background, if you look right there about the turbo, you can see the, the downspout of the uh, radiator. That is our biggest issue, so that's what we're trying to come up with and think outside the box to make this work about swapping radiators and losing or moving to a smaller radiator and possibly make the car run hot. So we come up with a plan to make this work. So. We had to wait for uh, the availability of our welder, so we just decided to go ahead and do everything we could until we can get to the welder. All right, we got the onboard air and everything plumbed in now. We have to get our radiator fixed. I'll put a picture of what we come up with yesterday on it. While we wait for our welder, Charles does his magic on this LSA. Shade performance at its finest. They say if it works, it ain't stupid. And this one works. So, it's outside the box, so check it out.
Now let's see how it all goes together. An hour, dude. That's all it took. Only in Florida do you get preheated water, though. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? It's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. We're out here in Mexico. bird back on the trailer got a minor oil leak in it but um, looks like it's gonna be fine just gotta fix the gasket on the uh, drain pipe on the turbo return line um, get ready to head out from the hotel I think I had about two and a half hours sleep but appreciate you Florida it's been a hell of a weekend we had fun did some testing last night 
farm truck and yeah next stop fuel up the truck and on the road Sunday morning, 7.20, got the bird back there, like I said, we filled up, we're on the road now, ETA, looking about 1.15 if I don't stop at all, but I know I'm about to stop at some point and go to the bathroom, but man, look at this weather, hopefully we can make it home for them. looking like a shit, out here. Of course, we're part of the no hood crew, but I got the turbo covered up. Hopefully, we can get, beat all the rain. It's calling for like, I think, 7% chance of rain down here in Florida. So maybe I can get across the Florida Georgia line, not the van, uh, before all the rain hits. My luck, like, I'll probably hit it in South Carolina as I'm growing up. But all right, here we go. Oh my God, look, it's not just a band. Florida Georgia line. We're making pretty good time. It's starting to sprinkle on me, but I think we can beat this rain. All full of marshes. Here we go, Florida Georgia line. We're almost home, we got about another hour 